You're driving, boss. That's what's up, G. Wow, you're tall. It's always interesting driving a different car. Yeah. No, that's me. I'm sorry. One second. <laughs> Poor Mr. Worry. Whatever happened, he worried about it. Oh, nice. Yeah, he's merging left. I like it. Yeah. Be bold. It's a holiday. You Take that left. Yes, sir. It's a holiday, officer. It's family day. We're going to my parents' house. Are we 15 meters away from the curb? Which, uh... One day, he went for a walk. He was worried that he might walk too far and not be able to get home. So you're driving out your bag and we're going to buy some books? We're going to buy some books for my nieces. That's lovely. On this beautiful family day. Yeah, on this beautiful family day. It's family day. It's family day. Mm. It's a holiday. I'm very worried about you, he said. Why is that? I think I'm going to change. You're gonna, you, okay, yeah, do it. Do it. Yeah. Yeah. I'm worried that one of these days you might hurt yourself. He said. Don't you worry ahead about that, replied Mr. Bump. And went off, tripping over his own feet. She's not on, mate. It's a bit of skew though. Oh eh? yeah, it is. No, look at that. Yeah. <laughs> That's the ticket. Third time's a charm. My man. <laughs> That was quite a lengthy endeavor. Mr. Barry went on. He met Mr. Greedy. Hey! Really hung over it. Yeah, I just felt really bad yesterday. I hear ya. Quite, uh, just not liking my decision. So... Sounds like being hung over. Yeah. Blur State's a lot different than it used to be. Yeah. That's all I have to say. If he set off shopping, he worried that the shops would be shut when he got there. Oh, there's a Chipotle, there's a bulk barn. David's tea. Oh, the schnitzel hub. Yeah. I love a hub. Schnitzel's a new one. He met a wizard. Hello. I said what? Why don't you go home? and write down every single thing that you're worried about, and I'll make sure that none of these things will ever happen. They won't have anything to worry about, would all? Which one did you grab? Mr. Gr Grumble. He sat down to write out all the things that worried him. If Every single thing. Ooh, Mr. Lazy. We're right next to each other. Here yeah. Hi, Mr. Grumble and Mr. Lazy. Yeah. I'm both. It's a long list. So, Mr. Fussy looks like Hitler, kind of, and Mr. Nosy looks like a straight up Jew. <laughs> it's interesting that they're uh, <laughs> right under each other. Hitler was a bit of a fussball, wasn't yeah, he? Yeah, he was. Leave it to me. I'll go off and make sure that none of these things will ever happen. I mean, if this isn't a coincidence, I don't know what is. Wait, she's not quite ready to hear. This looks like Hitler and this looks like a Jew. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Do you know about the Holocaust? That day was the first day in Mr. Worry's life that he didn't have a single thing to worry about. On Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, Mr. Worry didn't have a care in the world. But, on Monday morning, he was a worried man. Who's a responsible son? That's what's up. He went to see the wizard. Oh dear. Oh yeah, I'm in a good place, emotionally and <laughs> physically. 
in a really good place. Yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> I'm worried because I don't have anything to worry about. And he went home to worry. Thank you.